I'm Alistair Spalding. I'm the Artistic Director and Co-Chief Executive of Sadders Wells. So there are many other uh, prizes uh, for other disciplines. The Turner Prize, the Booker Prize are famous ones. Um, and I think it's about time there was one for dance. There are two categories. Uh, first, the Rose Prize, which is the main prize. Uh, that's for full-length work for more experienced uh, choreographers. And the second is the Bloom Prize, and that's for emerging choreographers who have had no more than 10 years experience. So my name is Akram Khan. I'm a choreographer, stroke, almost retired dancer. And what the Bloom Prize and the Rose Prize together does is that it's not just about artists who have perhaps arrived in a certain place, but who are arriving. So it focuses more on the process and the journey of an artist. We had nominators from seven different regions around the world, and they basically looked at work over a two-year period and decided on the best. They nominated those. They could also nominate one uh, uh, artist or a production from another region, the wild, wild card. Uh, we brought all those nominations together. Then there was another selection jury who had a very difficult job of whittling that down to the seven that are represented in the final. I'm Es Devlin. Uh, I'm an artist and a stage designer, and I'll be designing the Rose Prize. It's a real honour and a privilege to design an object that will signify hopefully a really broad conversation around this most urgently needed art form of dance. Prizes are funny things because it's hard to judge, you know, it's great to not judge, but that said, a prize is actually a ritual and it's a ceremony. And what it does is it draws energy and conversation around a medium. It's international, so it's really from everywhere, from Brazil to Portugal to Athens, etc. So it reflects some of the issues that were rising to the top in that period, the COVID, post-COVID, uh, issues of identity, the shifting political landscape and, and climate change. All of that is represented somehow in, in these works. So really doing what we aim to do, which is represent not just the trends in the work, but also what was happening in the world and how dance reflects that. It's not just about the winners, but it's also about the ones who didn't win. Why didn't they win? Um, how was it chosen? The, 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 the important thing is that we're having dialogue um, and that's what it creates. It creates dialogue. To have a prize specifically for dance, but more specifically for choreographers and choreography, it's quite rare. Choreography is basically, for me, it's about storytelling. And it's storytelling through the gathering of human patterns. And I think what the Rhodes Prize and the Bloom Prize does is really kind of homes in on the celebration and the power of the human body.